Hey guys! So I just wanted to do a quick video, fairly quick video, of what's inside my diaper bag. It was requested way back when I first got this bag and I just never got around to doing it until now and I just wanted to go ahead and do it so that people don't think I'm completely ignoring them. Um, so this is my Petunia Pickle Bottom bag that I got. It is a like waxed canvas type of bag so that it doesn't get stains and it can get wet and it doesn't ruin it. Um, front part of this, I'll show you real quick before I show you what's inside, is a diaper changing area. We've got baby wipes. We have desitin for prevention of diaper rash. I keep a spare cloth diaper and liner in here. And then this zips up and stows away, which is great, so it's out of the way. And then, inside my bag, I have just a crib blanket slash, you know, stroller blanket, just an extra blanket to have just in case it gets cold wherever we're at. And then, let's see if I can get this open. This is my extra pacifier holder. And... It holds two, one on each side, so that they stay clean. As you can see, I have a favorite brand. That would be Suavenex. So that way I can actually just hang it on the outside if I want to, or even on the stroller while I'm out and about. I have one pre-filled bottle, so that in case whoever I've got with me is hungry. Then I actually have an extra bottle, just in case I need to put water in it or anything, anything like that, or more formula. And then we also have pacifier wipes, just in case they fall out of there. It's good to keep them clean. We have a burp cloth, so that way, make sure that there's no mess. And then we also have colic tablets in case baby gets an upset tummy while we're out and about and it can't get home right away. There's nothing worse than having an uncomfortable baby when you're out and about. Then I also keep, um, like, I don't know, three or four disposable diapers. I've got a couple of pampers in there, and then I'm not sure of this brand, but they're one of my favorites. It's very cute. It's like little sleeping bees, and you all seen the pampers prints of those. Everybody had those for a while. And then I also have another baggie. Um, I keep the in baggies for the reason of should they get wet or spit up on or they, God forbid, have a blowout. Um, you know what newborn babies do in their diapers. Um, an extra onesie, an extra sleeper, and then another clean blanket just to have as a spare. Um, so that way, if I'm swapping, I can just throw them in a bag. Or if the bag gets wet on the inside of a bottle leaks, then that's why I like to keep them in actual baggies. I figured that's the best way to keep them from getting wet in transit and amongst the traveling. <laughs> so that is, I think, it. Yes, I think that's it. That's what I keep in my diaper bag. So we'll put them back in. You can see that they... Um, there are nice pockets for everything, so I can keep it nice and organized. And then the blanket goes on top. And then I'm prepared for most things I will need being out and about. And that's pretty much it, guys. So I'm prepared to go on an outing, and I'm hoping maybe in the next week I can take um, one of the babies out. Um, I'm actually, I have a new car seat slash stroller attachment that's coming in the mail. Hopefully this week um, I needed to order something neutral and wanted to get something um, new to go with my, my Buzz Quinny 3 stroller. So I made sure I got something that's compatible with that. So I'm really excited because it's one of the very new versions of um, the... Uh, Maxi Cozy car seat. I think it's the, uh, I want to call it the Primo, Prizo, Prizo, 
something like that. But when it arrives, I will be sure to show you guys. I, I got it in a nice um, natural, like the beige, a light beige color. So it's a very neutral color, but it looks good for boys and girls. Um, I still have my whole stroller set um, system my with my Maxi Cozy original pink car seat um, and then the matching bassinet and the stroller feature, but for Baby Bentley that would not work very well, so I did not want to have to take him out in a girl color, so this, this whole thing will still go well with it. So I'm really excited to get that and use it, so when that arrives I'll be sure to share it with everybody. And then I can take them out and about, and I will be planning on doing some videoing of it. So, anyways, thank you guys all for watching. It is Sunday evening now, and I'm going to go um, get caught up on a few videos and kind of um, call it an early evening because I'm back to work tomorrow. So, um, I hope everybody enjoys the rest of their evening. And I want to say thanks for the huge support on my last video. I was very nervous to post the video. I didn't know um, what kind of reactions I would get from people. And my goal was never to um, offend or hurt anybody's feelings. I just wanted to, you know, talk about something that's been on my mind for a little bit. So I'm, I'm glad that others have felt the same way. It makes me feel better knowing that I might be in the majority, not the minority, in thinking um, what we do think about Ardell, so thank you all for taking the time to comment on that. I really, really appreciate your feedback. It's what makes me feel closer and closer to the friends that I've made here on YouTube. So thanks, guys. I really appreciate it. So, all right. I'm going to stop rambling now. Everybody have a great night, and thank you again for watching. Bye-bye.